Okay, so we're going to install a new version and upload the new Arduino code. So we want to search for it rather than just finding a link. So I'll ag open GPS. <laughs> oh, sorry. That's okay. And, and then, then GitHub, right? GitHub, yes. Look at you go. Okay. So we want to find the release. Where's the, uh, there you go. Now we want to do the latest version, so it's the top, so 4.1.1. Just click here. Yep. Now just go down a little bit. You want to download the installer. So this one first, right? Sure. Doesn't matter which one. Double click. No, just click. You know, double click on the internet. Save. <laughs> <laughs> True thing. Save file. Okay, now get the support files. That's got the PC board and the Arduino. And okay, this one? Yep. Save file. And then go up here, right? Yep. To the arrow. And then go to the folder. Yeah, it doesn't matter which one. It comes up the same place. So now if you double click that, you can run the installer. This one? Okay. Now we just answer the questions. Now nice. that, there isn't a version on here, but it doesn't matter because it'll update the one that is on there if it is installed. Okay. So it'll replace what? Yeah. If you had an older version? Okay. Yep. So now I just ask for user account control. This doesn't show up in the video, but this is Windows 7. Windows 10 is the same way. And close. And, close. and then this is support files, right? Yep. So then unzip those. Oh, do I just have to go back? Uh, yeah. Sorry. There you go. Right click. And seven then, zip. where is it again? 7-zip. Yeah. And then extract to support files? Yeah, that makes its own little directory. Okay, in there, you can see the PCB and then the Arduino code. So we want to upload the Arduino code. So guess where the Arduino code's hiding? I forget. It's in the Arduino code. <laughs> <laughs> so just double click. Yep. So and it's this one, right? Uh, USB. And then auto steer USB INO. Whew. Then we're going to make sure he's connected. So up at the tools. It's this arrow, no, right? No, no, Up at the tools. Oh. Make sure we're connected. And the board's in Arduino Nano. Old boot load. And COM5. And that's the one it's connected to. So that's good. Okay. And now upload. Compile and upload. Now down at the bottom there, it'll blurb and go across and it'll say compiling. All I did was click on that arrow at the top to the right. Yep, it does the compiling and now it's uploading. See where it says uploading? Yep. Down at the bottom. Okay. And now it's done. All right. Now exit out of that. And this. And exit out of that. And, and exit out of that. And then I'm opening. Yep. I agree to the terms and conditions. You promise never to drive? <laughs> And then here, right? Yeah, look at that. There's serial ports. Now we want to attach it. Make sure it's talking. So go to the COM port. I do. COM5. And hit connect. If you want to connect. Which is what I want to do, right? Yeah. There. It's talking. Now just hit that little micro switch over there. Which yep. is that? That this one? one? Yep. Oh, see? Now it says 5. Push it again. Now it says 7. It's working. Success. Awesome. Success. Thank you. You're welcome. Have fun, everybody.